Hi! This screencast will show you how to install the latest pre-release of Qt460, codenamed Tower. Before starting, we need a working at 60 development environment consisting of Carbide C++, Active Perl, and a 60 platform SDK and the Nokia PC suite. Now, we want to get the Qt460 installer. Let's visit the Qt460 pre-release website and download the installer on the top of the page. During the download, we should have a look at the patches page. Some updates to our environment may be required, such as an updated compiler for the 60 emulator or a recent OpenC version. Now, let's run the Qt460 installer. Here we can decide to install the Qt sources and we can choose the S60 SDK for our Qt development. The Qt folder has to be on the same drive as the S60 SDK. When finished we also have a start menu with all kinds of helpful shortcuts. For example the Qt for S60 introduction will suggest how to proceed after the installation. In order to develop Qt for 60 applications in Carbyte, we need to tell Carbyte where we installed Qt. Under Window, Preferences, Qt, we add our Qt version by giving it a name and setting the Qt path. Our phone needs to have the Qt libraries installed in order to run Qt applications. In the Qt installation folder we can find the according sys package. Let's install it. There is also the fluid launcher demo. Let's install that in order to see how nice Qt looks on our phone. Apparently we successfully installed Qt and the Fluid Launcher demo on the phone. Thanks for watching and have a smooth installation of Qt460 on your computer and on your phone.